It's investigating yesterday's armed home invasion. Earlier that morning, there was a shooting a couple of blocks away. But starting next week, it will not be the Green Acres the Police Department investigating these types of crimes in this particular jurisdiction. It will, in fact, be the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. The now's Alyssa Hyman joining us from what is still the Green Acres Police Department at this moment, at least for now, anyway. Alyssa, what can you share? Well, Shannon, in exactly one week from today, the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office will be taking over police services for the city of Green Acres as part of a merger. Now, if you can see, you can already see some of those changes taking place, like these parking signs over there reserved for deputy sheriff parking only. Now, starting Monday, that's when you should see the officers move into those green uniforms and those green cars for PBSO. The city council approved the merger back in August with a four to one vote. Now, according to the city, all but two employees were rehired with the sheriff's office. They've already gone through the necessary training with PBSO, and over the next week, they will just be working on some of those technical changes like the 911 calling systems and the computer systems. All of this aimed at giving law enforcement more resources to fight crime in this community. Our city could really never afford the resources that the infrastructure of the sheriff's department has. And, and I'm not just talking about canine units and traffic control, but all the resources, the infrastructure. Now this transition will have an impact on the city's fire services since, since the um, police and fire services were all under one department. The city is now looking for a fire chief and that search is now underway. Now coming up, all new at five, the residents who are looking forward to this new change and we'll hear from them. Alyssa Hyman for us this afternoon. Appreciate the coverage.